Holland had AIDS, so does San Francisco and L.A. So Curry's telling the truth. Or part of the truth. You say it's a mercy killing, you don't do 15 to life. Well, because someone has AIDS doesn't mean he can't be murdered. Well, where does that get us? He's killing these AIDS patients for kicks. I hated Bobby being that way. I hated the people he hung out with. I hated the way he lived his life. But this guy, Curry, you shouldn't put him in jail. He shot your son. You read the articles, newspapers. Not an easy way to go. Bobby wanted to die. You can't be sure of that. Yes, I can. Bobby asked me to shoot him first. I knew Bobby was gay. We just couldn't talk about it. I'll never have that chance now. That bastard Curry killed my son. You have to put that man in jail. The defense is going to make a very strong case that your son intended to die. I've been getting Bobby's mail. This letter, gay men allied against AIDS. Bobby had an appointment with someone to talk about taking AZT. My son wanted to live. The charges are murder in the second degree, conspiracy in the first degree, manslaughter in the first degree, criminally negligent homicide, promoting a suicide attempt, and reckless endangerment in the second degree. Does the defendant wish to enter a plea? Yes, Your Honor, not guilty on all counts. Do the people have a bail recommendation, Mr. Stone? In this case, is a homicide, Your Honor, and despite the circumstances, we feel that some bail is necessary. Personally, I'm uncomfortable releasing any homicide defendant without substantial bail, but I do not feel that this defendant is a major flight risk. $50,000, short date. Our government is killing us through neglect. The mayor, the governor, the president, they have blood on their hands. While we are dying, they're prosecuting Jack Curry. Take the money from the district attorney and give it to the health department. Mr. Gordon, do you think the prosecution is hostile to people with AIDS? If Bobby Holland was dying of Alzheimer's and Jack Curry wasn't gay, would they charge him with murder? Every gay activist in the country is going to be after us. I understand, Adam. A gay straight is not the issue. Murder masquerading as assisted suicide is the issue. Now, let's say we drop all the charges and we just go for a misdemeanor. We're not ignoring the gay straight question. We're making it the only question. And you know what that is? Good politics. Yes, and bad law. It is not compassion. It's pity for gay people. And pity is one step away from ridicule. Now, what if Bobby Holland wanted to die? How does anybody know what went through Bobby Holland's mind five minutes before he died, or two minutes, or 20 seconds, or one second? And Jack Curry, who's done this twice before, did he talk him into it? Can't change the fact that Holland was gay and Curry is gay. What I can't change is that Jack Curry didn't bring pills and leave them. He didn't bring a gun and leave it. He pulled the trigger. Bobby Holland didn't need an angel of death. Huh? He wasn't that sick yet. He didn't want to die. Look, you're HIV positive. Huh? If you think you'll hang around till you get sick, you start to feel lousy, it's uh, hardly unusual to think about suicide. Bobby wanted to kill himself. I told him not to. And? He said he'd think about it. Going on AZT, trying experimental drugs. I saw Conrad Gordon on TV. Anybody want to call Jack Curry a hero? I tell him to look at me. I was diagnosed with AIDS when it was still called GRID, for God's sake. I'm still here. Curry had no right to shoot Bobby Holland. OK, thanks. You're saying Bobby Holland might have reconsidered. If he'd reconsidered, my client wouldn't be here. You don't know that. I don't know that. And even you don't know that, Mr. Curry. You were involved in those cases in California. Do you have a stake in getting these people to die? No. Mr. Stone, I don't. 
Did you try to talk Bobby Holland to Oliver? Several times over several hours. He didn't want to turn into a zombie. What if it were your son, Mr. Stone? If it were my son? I'd take him to every hospital in America try to save him. We'll plead to promoting a suicide. You plead to manslaughter one. We'll drop the other charges and we'll make a sentencing recommendation. Bobby Holland intended to shoot himself. Manslaughter one is an admission. My client intended to shoot him. He didn't shoot him full of penicillin. We're finished here, Jack. What, Mr. Stone, I hope you never have to face these choices yourself. I mean, I hope you never see anybody dying the way I've seen people die. But if you do, I hope you have the courage to do whatever has to be done. 